Good morning everybody, so I know this is super random and really weird and you're probably wondering like why the hell am I sat here talking to you looking like this um, but basically I thought I would do another vlog today just because I really enjoyed filming my Ibiza vlogs um, if you haven't seen those I'll leave links down below and you can go and check those out um, sorry about my voice, I've got a really sore throat ever since I got back from Boardmasters um, and I'm just feeling a little bit crap so my throat doesn't sound too great when I talk um, but yeah, basically my mum and dad have gone away for my mum's birthday. They've gone off to Cheltenham for a little bit. Um, so I've been left to fend for myself. And me and my sister have been texting and we decided that we thought we would make the most of today and spend a bit of quality time together because me and my sister don't get to spend that much time. Um, sort of just the two of us, we don't get to do it as much as we'd like because she lives with her fiancé in their little house and obviously I still live at home with my mum and dad. Um, so yeah, we thought we'd do something nice today and I think we are going to go and have some lunch at a nice posh hotel so we can get dressed up a little bit and just go out and have a nice girly day so I thought I would vlog the day um, hopefully I managed to get enough footage to actually make a vlog I'm gonna try my very best because the next few days are gonna be so boring so I won't have anything to add on to um, so I'll try my best to make this vlog good but yeah I just thought I'd bring you along with me today so I do hope you enjoy the vlog doing my hair and makeup well that's a lie I haven't done my hair I've just finished doing my makeup my hair is still drying because I just had a shower um, and I need to take all of my breakfast stuff downstairs and wash it up I'm not used to doing all of these house kind of chores there's so much you have to like actually think about um, but yeah I need to take my stuff downstairs get that washed and I still don't really know what to wear I put on this I'll show you so I put this on but I feel like it's kind of boring it's like a oh crap my cat's about to go out the window no, get down. Naughty. So yeah, as I was saying, um, I've just literally got on high-waisted black jeans and then I've put this white top thing on, but I'm not really sure. I might kind of dress it up with a bit of jewellery and put some heels on or just get changed, but I don't know. I can never decide what I want to wear. Um, and obviously we're going to somewhere that's a little bit posh, so I kind of feel like I have to dress quite smart. And currently I'm used to dressing for being at a festival, so kind of struggling to actually decide what to wear and my cat's trying to eat a fly in the window. Okay, so after changing outfits about 50 times, I think I'm finally happy with what I'm wearing, but I'm not really sure. I've basically gone back to this top that I always wear, which is from New Look. Um, I just feel really comfortable in it and I just thought I'd chuck it on and I've kind of tried to dress up a little bit so it looks a bit more smart. Um, I'll just show you what else I've got on with it. 
So it's just like a very loose fitted blouse. I've put on like a silver bangle and a few rings and then I've still got the same black Joni jeans on and then these little shoes here which are from Office um, and I've got a kind of nude coloured blazer which I'm gonna just shove on the top as well. So I'm just waiting for Amber to arrive now and I really need to tidy up my room. Look how messy it is literally. I haven't made my bed yet today. There is clothes all over the floor that I didn't end up wearing in the end and I really really need to tidy it and there's stuff to tidy downstairs but I really just can't be bothered so I think I'm just going to be really lazy and leave it until I get home later um, but yeah I'm really excited for this little lunch hopefully it'll be a really nice day out okay shock I changed my outfit again um, I've basically changed up the bag I've got this red bag now instead and then I've put on this kind of floaty jacket-y thing um, instead of a black blazer just because I feel like it's a little bit too sunny outside to wear a black blazer and yeah, I don't know. So this is the outfit I've gone for and I'm not going to let myself change it again. now um me and my sister had such a lovely day i really hope that i managed to get quite a few um clips of the day because it was just so much fun we had a really lovely lunch um at a place called the magdalene chapter which is a hotel in exeter which is sort of near where i live um so we went there had a really nice lunch had a glass of champagne with it which was so nice um and then we just had a little trip into town, popped into Lush and I picked up a little something which you will have already seen um, and then we got a Costa and drove home and it was just really really lovely to spend the day with her. Um, I'm gonna attempt to carry on vlogging for the rest of the day but I'm not really sure how interesting it's gonna be because I've literally got home, I'm gonna take off my makeup, I'm already in my pyjamas as well like lounging clothes, um, I'm gonna take my makeup off and just tidy up my messy room because it is literally disgusting. Um, and then I'm going to just lie in bed and watch Netflix for the rest of the day because I'm super tired and I feel so full. I've eaten so much food and yes, I do hope you enjoyed watching those clips. Um, I probably will carry on vlogging because I'll probably find something remotely interesting to do later which I will film for you. So I will carry on filming for the rest of the day but yeah, me and my sister had such a lovely day and I thought I would just have a quick catch up with you now.
tidied my room but I got kind of bored so I think I'm just going to take my makeup off and then get into bed and catch up with Pretty Little Lies because I'm still on series 3 I think it is and obviously currently it's on like series 6 on telly and basically last night everybody was tweeting who A was because a has now finally been revealed, but because I am not up to date with it, it's literally like ruined it for me now, but I'm still going to watch it anyway just because it's a good program and I just want to watch it. Um, but yeah, I'm so tired. I'll just quickly show you what I picked up from Lush because I'm really, really excited about it. So um, in Lush I managed to pick up the Comforter Shower Gel because... If you like know me at all, you will know that I absolutely love the Comforter Bubble Bar. I've got one in my bathroom at the moment. I constantly use it. Um, I like always have to have one because I just love the smell so much. And then I saw that they had brought this out. I think they had it before, but I never managed to get my hands on one. So I'm super excited. I've now got it. It literally smells incredible. It smells like blackcurrant sweets. And I'm definitely going to have a bath later on and use the Bubble Bar and the shower gel so I'll probably vlog that in a bit. So I got way too hot in my dressing gown but I just thought I'd quickly show you um, something that I've done. So basically my mum and dad have gone away at the moment because it is my mum's birthday. Sorry I'm gonna look really like weird as I'm doing this. Um, but yeah basically it's my mum's birthday today which is the 12th of August. Um, and her and my dad have gone away to Cheltenham for the weekend, um, so that's why I've been at home by myself. And I just thought I'd quickly show you what I've done for her birthday for when she gets home tomorrow. So one of our family friends already bought my mum these gorgeous flowers for her birthday. Um, but I picked up these little pink roses when we were out in town today um, for her. And I've put them in a little vase and basically I've got all of her presents here. And I'm just going to sort of place them around the fireplace um, and I thought I would show you what I'm going to do. So I'll tell you um, what I got my mum for her birthday just because she will probably watch this vlog after it's her birthday which is absolutely fine. Um, so I got her these little roses here which are just really pretty. I've just put them in a little vase. And then from Jo Malone I picked her up um, one of the little perfumes in Peony and Blush Suede because she really likes that scent so I thought I'd get her a perfume. And I also got her a matching candle to go with it. And then down here I've picked up and then this one here is um, the Naked 2 palette because Mum's already got the Naked 3 palette but she said she was after... Oh god, I look nice. And she's already got the Naked 3 palette but she said that she wanted to try another one so I picked her up number 2 just because I think she would like number 2 better than number 1. And then I got her a couple of bits from Lush as well. Um, and then yeah, so I've just left it on the fireplace for her so when she comes back it will look cute tomorrow because I'm cute like that. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to have a bath and use my new... Lush Comforter shower gel stuff and I've got the matching bath crumble as well so I thought I'd have a nice little relaxing bath. So I apologise for the really weird lighting um, but I just thought I would probably end the vlog here. Um, I have got my pyjamas on had a really nice bath um, and I've just cooked myself some dinner. I made some macaroni cheese with lots of ketchup because I'm pretty hungry. I'm not really too sure why my skin is looking so red in this um, light. I um, do apologise, I look really strange. But yeah, I'm going to end the vlog here. I do hope you enjoyed it. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. I'm really going to eat my food now because I'm super hungry. But I'll see you all very soon. Bye! So I know I said I was going to bed and finishing the vlog, but basically I've been watching a film called Spring Breakers, you've probably all heard of it, um, and I thought I would give it a go, and I've got like pretty much just over halfway through the film, and it's literally the most boringest slash crappest film I've ever watched in my life, so I've actually just turned it off and given up because it was doing my head in. It was just, there was literally no story to it, so I just felt the need to tell you guys that if you haven't seen Spring Breakers... I don't recommend you bother because it is literally so boring. So I'm probably just going to watch some rubbish on telly and then just fall asleep. But I just thought I'd let you know. So anyway, goodbye again. Raymond is the Smashbox.